What are the limitations of power apps? Some limitations of the power apps include performance issues with large data sets, limited offline capabilities, complex business logic limitations and potential licensing calls for the premium features. There are also constraints and integrity of some legal systems handling large scale legacy system and handling of the large scale enterprise and application. How do you manage security and permissions and power apps? Security and permissions and power apps are managed through the role based access control also called as RBAC that is provided by the common path data service. Users can also be assigned nodes with the specific permission. How does power apps integrate with Microsoft Flow? Power apps can trigger flows in power automate allowing for the complex workflows and automation of processes. For example, an app created in the power apps can start a flow that sends an email notification, updates records in a database. Describe a scenario where you have used power apps to solve a business problem. In one scenario, we developed a power app for the field service team to manage their daily tasks. The app allowed technicians to view their assigned jobs, update the job statuses and capture the customer signations and the long hard work. It integrated with the Dynamic 365 to update the job records in the real time and the data accuracy. How can you deploy and share power apps with your users in your organization? Power apps can be shared with users in organizing by assigning the apps to the users or groups in the Power Apps portal. Developers can set permissions to control who can view or edit the app. Apps can also be